hi to Chaco. We have played here on the blue at the bottom right. We have on the top left, we have Lolite in the red, of course. He is so beautiful. And Blade is also beautiful. Who is more beautiful? This is a game of beauty, guys. This is not about war. This is not about hatred. This game is all about who is more beautiful. Is this going to be Blade? Or is it going to be Loliath? Look at this ancient war. Is this going to be a warden? Let's see. That's a warden. Oh my god. A warden here for Loliath. Loliath with the warden. This is so insane. This is so sick. There's an Archmage here for uh, Blade. And of course he will get some footman. And there's a footman. That's one footman already. He's building more peasants. Footman and peasants. What a start here uh, for uh, for Blade. That is such an amazing start. With the footman. With the uh, Archmage. Against that, against that Warden. The Archmage is already over halfway done. Over halfway done training. It's apparently uh, doesn't take long to train the Archmage. There's an archer and the warden. She's gonna be so beautiful. Even though you won't see half of her face. Doesn't mean she's not beautiful. The moon wall is going up. Second moon wall that is. The wisp is going into the tree. But you find some bones. These are dragon bones. I assume. And not dinosaur bones. Even though this map is called Ancient Isles. The sheep bad. The wisp is still scouting the footman. He finds the warden. He finds the archer. Here comes the archmage with the militia and the footman. Coming for this warden, coming for her neck, you know, her head, I guess. But she, they're gonna cut off her neck, gonna cut off her head at her neck. This, uh, this archer retreats, she doesn't want to die yet. She knows uh, what's happening. This wisp, <laughs> oh no, wisp, no detonate, no detonate. The warden gets a level 5 null, she gets a parry up, and this ancient war is in trouble. The warden is the only thing that's still alive here. Did he get the second wisp as well? Yeah, two wisps here. No detonates. 50 XP. And now he's just going to finish this creep camp. Is he going for an expansion over there? That would be so sick. Land laser, 98 critical uh, XP. Uh, <laughs> I just said, I just wanted to say critical strike there. It's just like 98. Usually after I used that uh, number, I say critical strike. But not in this case. It was XP in this case. 146 XP here for the uh, Archmage. The Borden just stole some creeps as well. So she has 159. She gets another one. She has 179 now. And his blade going for the expansion here. It seems like the peasants are... Oh, what's the archer? Okay, he's going to buy a Forceful Shadow Priest. Maybe a Berserker as well. The peasants are retreating. No expansion, shit. I want okay stacking. I wanted to see the expansion over here, but no, <laughs> not what Blade has in mind. Footman, right clicking this uh, warden, but the warden she sells something. She wakes up the creeps. She has a boots of speed. She's hiding now. She's hiding in the shadows. Archmage next to the sheep. A player's forces are under attack. Okay, well, is this the new strategy against the warden? Just one base, one base, stack up to keep, build a lumber mill, build the arcane vault. Is he going for the towers? He's getting footman defend. This is a nice play here. There goes another null. Archmage totally level 2 now. This knoll is also dead. We have four moonwells. And here's the Archmage. He, he was expecting expansion, I think. Chaco, you seem excited. It is because we have this be beautiful warden. Look how beautiful she is with her boots. Oh, she's going for the water elemental. She laughs at it. And does he? No, she doesn't get XP. Played here the nice the uh, XP there. And the Archmage, you know, he's uh, summons a water metal. Do we see dispels? We see one dispel. We see two dispels. Uh oh. Archmage is in trouble. He's, he's running on his horsey. Again, he's being laughed at. <laughs> this is such. Oh, and he just TPs out. Did you drink too much coffee this morning? No, I don't drink coffee. I don't drink anything besides water and protein uh, water. 
keep is going to be up here in a moment. But I did get a caffeine pill, but I don't feel like I'm particularly high energy. I just, this game is just super exciting. Archmage, he has a healing potion. Is he going for something funky here? I don't see any tier 2 buildings. Oh, never mind. I do see there are tier 2 buildings. There's an Arcane Sanctum and there's another one. Okay. So he's um, gonna get a Naga maybe? No, Naga? Naga? There's a Naga. Naga here for Blade. The Naga is of course, you know, nice and stuff, but against a Warden. At least he will force her to pick Blink. She did get the Ankh. Oh, the Ankh. Now the Warden is not going to die anytime soon. Let's see if we see some right clicks. Oh, these arches. Two arches. One dies. The other one uh, survives because there's no dust. If only he had dust. But you know what? Sometimes you just don't have dust. Warden is such a little bu uh, such a bully. Would be better if we saw some death of heroes. Wait, the death, death of heroes. <laughs> laughing at the poor AM, yeah. She just, you know, keeps laughing at him. This ogre is dead. We have a level three warden now. Naga picks up a nice tome. Here comes the warden. She laughs at the lich, uh, the Naga now. I mean, of course she laughs at her. She's like a fish on land. But, you know, still, it's a pretty mean thing to do. Again, there's a level 2 laughter. And this, uh, oh, he gives a healing potion to the Naga. Now the Warden, she blinks out. So no fan of knives this game. There's a fake Naga over there. Poor nerd AM. So we have a nerd and a fish. These are easy targets to bully for that uh, warden. What was that? Oh, it was the illusion Naga. Double ancient ward. I guess he was afraid of a tower rush. Uh, double ancient of lore. He even has triple ancient of war, by the way. He's like, okay, as long as I can, as I can survive the uh, the, uh, whatever attack, I will win the game. He even has nature's blessing. So he went triple ancient of war, nature's blessing. That's all just defense. Imagine a human player building three or four towers in his main. This is the similar uh, similar response. Although this is a bit, bit better, I feel like, because these guys are a bit more useful than towers in your base because you can creep with them. But still, it's uh, a very similar approach. He's just all out defending. And as long as there's no expansion uh, attempt here for Blade, it makes sense. Bladesmith going up because Blade's going for this uh, Tower Rush. So these three Ancient of Wars are going to be so powerful now. And Blade, I mean, did he not scout those? I mean, the the fake Naga scouted a little bit. If he, if you see three Ancient of Wars with Nature's Blessing, I mean, are you really going to Tower Rush that? I don't think uh, he realized what he was up against. But we'll see. Naga, of course, everyone laughs at the Naga. <laughs> Oh, one tower is going down fast. This angel ward is making a path here through the trees. And uh, this angel ward ate a tree or something. This one could go... Oh, Archer-chan is... Is she dead? She is dead. And uh, this dryad is doing just fine. Uh, there goes a priest, though. Berserker, you know, in the back. There go all the towers. Uh, Blade, I mean, you know, if he needs to kill on the Naga. But even if he does, the Naga will come back. She has an Ankh. The Naga is just trying to go for this fish. But, you know... Fish is still alive as a healing potion. Uh, maybe undefend and retreat. <laughs> Blade, you don't need defend if no piercing units are attacking you. Oh, the warden, you know, she's pretty low. Hello, footman. Oh, he, what? He's still playing this so aggressively. I, I don't like this. Period. I just don't like it. Like, you're never gonna win against Ancient of Wars. Not with footman. Hi Chaco Chadlings, hello Batfan16. These dryads, I mean they're beautiful, but he has so many dryads. Is he going bears? He's going to of eternity. He's going bears. 
I mean, the dry is of course not that great against the footman, but he's just he can just ignore the footman with the blink on the warden with the uh, <laughs> on the naga. The warden uh, she does use her healings and everything. She will kill the warden, but uh, the naga, but also the tower. Uh, maybe he can get a warden. No, the warden now level four, level uh, two blink. The archmage is dead. This GG, GG first game won here by Loliath. I mean, it was just. Maybe poor scouting here by Blade. Maybe he didn't have a backup strategy. And he just went for the Star Wars anyway. Because he didn't know what else to do. Um, maybe... I don't know what else it could be. Maybe he never played against Ancient Wars. He just didn't think about it. He just he just didn't, didn't think someone could defend this well. But... Uh, He's, he's dead, guys. <laughs> There's no way for Blade to come back. We have one base against one base, but we have tier 3 bears. We have a level 4 warden against a level 2 and a level 1. Good luck, Blade. Sure, sure, you can wish uh, Blade some more good luck, but he needs so much luck to, to win this game. Like, how is he gonna come back? How is he ever gonna make this comeback? Of course, the fish, she's laughed at again. She tries helping her uh, out a little bit. For gliding, okay, maybe killing the warden once and uh, activating that arc is a good start. This uh, fish hero, is she going to die? She is so low on hit points. She will die to the poison. But can she kill the warden before she dies? Okay, the warden does die once, but he needs to kill the warden again. And then we have a comeback here for Blade. Uh, these All these casters are going to die, though, to the dryads. And uh, there's uh, some laughing at the Archmage. If the Archmage dies, you know... Well, that's gonna be expected actually. The Archmage is dead. Oh, he has level 3 blink here. He, uh, the Archmage is level up. Le and he's dead. So, uh, do we see GG Blade? There it is, GG. GG, GG. First game goes to uh, Lolliot. Okay, second game here. Lolliot is 1-0 up. Who's not 1-0 up? Blade. He's 1-0 down. He is a map behind. But all he needs to do is win this map and will be uh, equal again. Sounds pretty easy. Especially for someone as good as Blade. The Ancient War. Oh, this is so risky here by Loliat. So risky. But maybe he just knows exactly how Blade plays and it's not risky at all. But what uh, Blade can do is send a militia. He's, uh, it's too late now, but much earlier. He can send a militia and kill this Ancient of War. Or cancel it at least. Don't think there's any wisp shenanigans you can do to, to stop it. Well, maybe there is. I'm not sure, but you know, Blade didn't go for it. So the risk paid off here for Lolliot. Another Warden, another Warden. How much chance we see a Keeper of the Grove? At this point, zero. <laughs> rank 173, wow. And now ranking up. This militia guy wakes up the creeps. There's an archer and the Ace of the War just attacking this peasant. Doing a lot of damage. The militia is retreating. This archer, does he shoot arrows at it? No, she doesn't. The Ace of the War fighting against the Renegade Wizard. And the archer, of course, shooting some uh, arrows into his side. And the archer, you know, she's so beautiful. She runs to the other side. There's the warden. Let's see if the footman can do something here. Maybe get a last hit. Uh, doesn't look like he tries even. The footman just go for the archer. We have a claws of attack here on the warden. Meanwhile, the archmage creeping over here. That's beautiful. The warden creeping over here. So much creeping going on. On one sound. On one, <laughs> on one sound. <laughs> In one game. There is the hunter's hole very early. The footman does scout it. So what does it mean? Double Ancient of War Huntresses? Maybe. Oh, did he get XP for that one? 188? I don't think so, right? Let's see. Uh, she does get the Footman. Which is 40 XP. I feel like the Ancient of War killed at one creep. But 188. I, I forgot how much XP they uh, all give together. Meanwhile, the Archmage is going for the next creep camp. Warden on her way. Oh, I could have checked maybe. That's my overlay, but it doesn't matter. It's uh, It does matter. But here comes the Warden. 
she's level two she has the claws of attack she has the glo uh, cloak of shadows which is useless because uh, she already comes equipped with the cloak of shadows as being a female night elf she kills a little peasant there goes the troll this troll also endangered oh and he dies the war uh, the arc is now level three that is so much uh, higher than our warden which is level two and a half this ancient ward taking a little bit of damage he's building huntresses ultra vision does he have a second ancient war i don't see one oh there's an ap so sneaky lolai it's so sneaky and this uh, frog blocking the archer quack the warden what is he gonna kill see she finds a peasant the archer shoots the arrow at the peasant and now uh going for the footman or this footman here takes a lot of damage there goes the footman okay warden going for these peasants you know this warden she wants level three but it's gonna take a while to get level three these peasants are very low she could easily no, she doesn't have that much mana. Oh, the, hunt the hunters though. The warden is just a distraction. So the hunters can kill these two peasants, but they survive. No, they, they don't survive. The warden finds them. Two of them die, plus one another one means three of them die. TP out here by the warden. Can he get a fourth one? Does everyone TP? No, the archer. Oh, the archer. That's the only unit that really needed to TP because she's dead. Like the first little shadow priest can escape. The hunters could have escaped. Only the archer there couldn't escape because she was already so low on hit points. The warden, she's so close to level 3. She's on her way. She's on her way across the map. Is Blade doing a great job this game? It does look like he's doing a pretty good job so far. It seems uh, it's going better than the last game. Sure, he lost some peasants, but he forced a TP. He still had an XP. He's still beautiful. And... Uh, of course, the attack is super late here for... Well, there's no attack for Loliath, but the AP is up. The AP is on their way. Nothing else yet here for Loliath. No second Ancient of War. No more AP. He buys some trolls. Oh, is this too much for Blade to handle? Blade, what can he do? What can Blade do? If his water elementals get dispelled... The hunters are going to be too strong. He sees the AP. The AP ate his way through the forest. And Blade is now panicking. He's like, oh shit. Water and metal. Attack the water. Uh, attack the moon well. Fill it with your water. Archman is coming. Oh, a footman one that went down. Do we see some dispels? Or he's going to keep this one alive. He uh, shadow strikes the Archman. There's a dispel. There's another one. Level 3. Uh, shadow uh, Arborden now. She steals. No, the Archmage stole the mana of the Warden. The Archmage TP is to this base. One peasant died already to the AP. Archmage here in the front. Summons another Water Elemental. Is there more Dispel? There is more Dispel. There goes the Water Elemental. And without Water Elementals, these Hunters are so strong. But there's a Shredder. What's the Shredder gonna kill? The Footman and Militia going for the AP. What's the Shredder going for? This, uh, this guy, first to Berserker. The Shredder is surrounded. He kills the AP though. And the Berserker does survive. Wow. And uh, ah, that's so expensive, of course, uh, Shredder. If only he had a few more towers, like five more towers, it would be easy peasy hold. But is he attacking? He is attacking. Blade just started his attack uh, just a moment ago. The warden laughs at the footman and he dies. Militia here helping out as well. One militia just right clicking this berserker. He cannot get it. The berserker is too fast. Berserker is still alive, 41 hit points. The warden kills another peasant with her tambourine. And now the Archmage is in a little bit of trouble. Is he in a lot of trouble? Is he uh, He's doing just fine. The Scar Tower going up. The Water Mentals almost kills the Hunters. The Hunters gets away. This Hunters, does she get away? The Warden on level 4, that's for sure. This uh, sneaky back entrance is so sneaky. He can save all his units through the forest. And uh, the, the Archmage is in trouble. It seems like like Lolite is just so insanely good. But now the Archmage is using the secret uh, route. But uh, Lolite uh, has set up a trap. It was all a trap in the first place. And he blinked in front of the Archmage, so the Archmage was stuck there, in the trees, and, uh, the town is under you know, Night Elves using uh, the forest to their full advantage. No surprise there, this car tower is going down, no way it goes up, and, oh, this guy loses a lot of mana. And so Hunters, is, I mean, one Hunters does fall, no XP gained there for anyone, because the Archmage is still dead. There goes another peasant, this warden, she's so beautiful, what's she going to kill next? She is going for, um, it's footman here. 
The warden, she's attacking peasants. The warden loses some mana. There goes the footman. This uh, footman is next. He's dead, guys. Me over here. This this guy has been attacking these angels of war all game long. Uh, the warden, she's level five. Is Blade gonna make this comeback? Of course he is. Hello. It is Blade. He has he has five peasants still. He will get his archmage back. He will be at 10 supply in a moment after he loses all of these units. And uh, that's how he's gonna make the comeback. He, he's gonna make a 10 supply comeback. Maybe 13 supply if he saves his three. Oh, GG. Play GG's out. And uh, I was wrong. The light wins 2 to 0.